This is Mike Finnerty of the Sure West Sports Show, and the following clip has been brought to you by the Sure West Sports Show, airing on SureWestSports.com. We move now to Little League Baseball, and in District 54, they have begun all-star pool play already. And on Saturday, we made our way out to Granite Bay for a major division matchup between host Lakeside and Folsom National. Let's get you right to the action, and after both teams scored a run in the first inning, the second inning was another story for Lakeside as their bats came alive. This base hit loaded up the bags for Matt Volker, who comes through in the clutch with a base hit of his own to center field. This would bring home a pair of runs to put Lakeside up 3-1. to one. Lakeside would go on to score four more runs in the inning thanks to an RBI hit by Darren Baker and a solo homer from Alex Daly to take a commanding 7-1 to one lead. In the bottom of the second, Lakeside starter Darren Nelson blanked the Folsom National offense with a pair of strikeouts, moving this game to the third inning with Lakeside still up 7-1. to one. A new inning, but the same result as the Lakeside bats continue to pound Folsom National pitching as Volker does it again, this time with a solo homer to right center field, much to the delight of the young Lakeside fans beyond the fence. And now we've got an 8-1 Lakeside lead. Still in the third with a runner on, Daly gets the base hit to left that falls in, putting two runners aboard with two out. And guess what? Lakeside goes long again, this time off the bat of Nelson, who crushes this blast deep over the center field fence. That would be good for three more lakeside runs. And now we've got an 11-1 ball game after three innings of play and lakeside looking to end this one early. Nelson pitched well into the third inning, keeping Folsom National off the board again. And in to replace Nelson was Daly, who was equal to the task as Daly pitched the final one and a third innings of this game allowing no runs as Lakeside cruises to the 11-1 victory as both teams continue with pool play this week.